Welcome back. Here we go. It's the VIP interview with Ryan Cabrera. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Jay in the VIP Celebrity Lounge, and I'm hanging out with Ryan Cabrera. He's about to go on stage soon, Word. right? We're going to go bowling. Going to go, yeah. A little we pre already did this. Little pre, great? little pre show bowling. <laughs> So tell me about the CD. What what's the CD's called? Uh, you, stand you stand watching. watching. Um, it's you know it's my second album and uh, it was cool. I got to produce it myself. So it was, I was in LA and I got to do some of it at my house too, which was was fun because I would you know I'd wake up and record some record, go back to bed and wake awesome. up again, sing some more, play ping pong and you know it was so it was like it was cool. It was like a nice chill vibe. I recorded the record actually in like three weeks, so it just kind of flowed. And, three weeks. Uh, yeah, it was really fast and just. It just happened, you know. At that rate, you could be really, really well off if you can write a record in three I know. weeks. Well, no, no, I wrote the. It took me like a month to write the record, right. but you know, just like the recording process, you know, getting to produce myself was like the the funnest part because I knew exactly what I wanted it to sound like. Right. So when I went in there, it was like, okay, this, 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 and uh, the players on it were amazing. So it's just a fun album to make, and I think it's a little bit more like. It's like the next step, you know. I want each record to keep getting better and better, and I think it's it's grown now, up. Now, did and the tone change? Did, um, did yeah. You oh, you know, it's it's kind of it's a little bit more. It's the same. It's still me, but it's, you right. know, it's still it's a little bit more jazzy and rock and and everything. And and I, you know, I think it's a record that like all ages can hear and be like, oh, I dig that. You know. So the uh, the studio you built in your house. Yes. It's it's like you picked out all the gear. Oh, it's everything. like a, it's like oh, it's like yeah, it's like a ghetto studio. You know, that's all you need. You know, you, people think like you have to have like this huge, like amazing, fancy studio, but and you, you don't? know, no, we just have like blankets up on a wall and uh, and a microphone, and that's the way I roll. That's awesome. Man. That's right. So the the first um, single was Shine On. Uh huh. Did really well. Shine and now On. Now the new one is Photo. About to come out like this next week. And you're shooting the video in two days in L. A. What's shoot. the concept of the video? Um, the video is kind of like the basic premise is is like you know this past relationship. I have this photo and this girl took. And uh, and uh, it's starting to disappear, and right. I am, I'm I'm like searching the world to try to find this girl before the picture disappears, and and uh, but you never know what's actually going to happen on set. You know things change, and and uh, when you get there, it, like I have no idea what it's actually going to be like. So right. who knows? Were you pissed when I'm you uh, show heard up. Nickelback's new song? I can't believe they have a song <laughs> called Photograph. Is it, it's nothing like that. I yeah, I don't care. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't bother you. Nah. So uh, you, let's see. You Performing tonight, mm -hmm. what's the best part of being on stage for you? What, what do you look forward to the most? Um, uh, uh, lots of free cookies my fans bring. Uh, it's really exciting. They, I, I, I have a bus full right now of chocolate chip cookies. Really? Yeah. From all those teenage girls that yes, are Yes, it's out of control. You'll see. You'll see. It's nuts. You really have tons of... They bring cookies? Yes. But it's, I don't know. My, fa my favorite part is just getting on stage and like, you know, once we start, you know, the vibe is just insane and, yeah. and my band is, is so good and, and just playing with them is, is exciting. Now, I want to talk about score. I've been watching it on TV and honestly, I... I yeah, I'm on the show. Yeah. How's that feel? It was pretty nuts. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty weird to see. Now, did you come up with the whole concept? I, you know, no, actually MTV called me about that and uh, I was like, that's the perfect show because I wanted to show, you know, like us writing songs right. and, and uh, how hard it actually can be and then performing and then I get to perform at the end of each episode so yeah. it's like a fun show like you get to watch you know people write songs the competition of like who's gonna win the date and you know every once in a while you get to hear a song that you may dig you know how often is that I don't know depends. <laughs> do you dig the songs uh, well you know I help them write them so I guess yeah. you know but it depends like some people were better than others so it was like right. some some sessions went like really good and some right. sessions went really uh, awry well, it's a, this show's a lot of fun. Yeah, it was I, fun. I really like it. Thank you. Are you. So how many have you got in the can? You got a bunch in the can? I'm done, yeah. I, done, I finished taping it. Nice. I did it this summer. We just Are, taped five weeks straight in a row. Oh, that's every great. Single, every single day. Cool. All right. Well, we're going to be back with more of Ryan Cabrera in the VIP Celebrity Lounge. Stay tuned. Stick around. we got the second half of our interview with Ryan Cabrera on the way.